Hello, uh, I am State Representative Zach Mako from the 183rd Lehigh and Northampton counties, and I'm here at the 102nd Farm Show uh, with Richard Vreeland, and uh, he's here, a contestant, I guess, and uh, doing some, some woodwork and some, I guess, bringing some parts from your deer farm out. Uh, do you want to explain a little bit about that and what you created here? Well, actually, every year the deer, naturally, they drop their antler. What I do is collect them until I have enough, and then I make chandeliers for, you know, just for a hobby. Right. And uh, it's getting to a point right now, you got a duck when you walk through my house. <laughs> but other than that, uh, it's the only thing you can't really eat off the venison. Off, yeah, off the deer. Now, um, I just had an interview with Secretary Redding. He's the Secretary of Agriculture. And I was asking him about chronic wasting and uh, we were just speaking a little bit about that. Now you said that, because you have a deer farm, that the, what was it, the game? What happened, the fishing game didn't have quite enough officers to handle the 800 and some deer farms that are in the state of Pensy. They turned it over to agriculture. Now agricultural is in charge of the deer farms. They have more people. And as far as I'm concerned, they're doing a very good job. No, because they come out, they check, they want to, they look at the deer, they don't go in and spook them, because the deer are naturally wild, but they can normally tell by the, uh, the deer, the way they look, the way they move, and for the past five, six years now, they've uh, given me a clean bill of health, which means I must be doing something right. Well, that's good to hear. Now, so going back to your creations here with this um, chandelier, and you also made the bench that's over there as well. Now, have you, over last year, what different techniques have you used, or did you change up your style and what you were doing as far as your creations? No, my creations just come with actually train of thought. I, I'll be sitting out watching the deer, and next thing I know, I said, maybe I can draw that on something. Uh, which I did last year and took first place in the... You had the artifact the table. Artif the artifact table. And now uh, we're just looking at helping and letting people know that there are deer farms out there. Right, and they, they shouldn't just push them to the side because they're not... They're feeding a lot of people that can't eat right. the beef and the pork. Right. And uh, I am very proud to be part of that association. And uh, in the beginning, it was a little difficult because uh, there were people that used to come stop on the farm. And I like to be on the farm because you don't know if they've changed their boots from another deer farm or not. But now they call every year. I welcome them out with open arms. And uh, it, it's, quite, it's quite the thing to belong to. And I know I'm doing right because like five, six years now, my deer have been accepted and being very very healthy now how did how did you do as far as placement in your categories um <laughs> this year because i know you said last year you won first place for your artifact table the artifact table was best in show harrisburg and allentown and best overall in allentown uh the bench uh, the creation came out second place apparently the judges thought i might have hit these deer with a car or made something out of it because uh, we didn't get an award on the antler chandelier. I think, I think the antler with the, the with the wagon wheel, I think it looks really slick. So I... Uh, it is what the judges have to be. Right. And uh, there's a lot of wonderful things. I've been here two days now and I'm just about beat walking around looking at the beauty that creations that people have here. And it's coming from their heart as well as stuff like this. It's, coming from my heart. Well, thank you, Mr. Vreeland. I appreciate you coming out, and it's good seeing you again this year, and I look forward to what you're making and creating next year. Appreciate it. Thank you, sir.